What is up? Brothers. We just hit 400 subscribers. Oh, epic. 400 subscribers. That's, that's a good person. Thank you very much. We need to get this straight problem. So, you probably know the video, uh, my Roblox tutorial, how to make a trail shop, which I actually explain about the model of my trail shop. It has a good ratio. Thank you very much. Thank you. A good amount of like ratio. It's super good. And you will see my comment section has a little bit of problems, but I have some people that do not know how to give money. So this comment said, Hey, how can you make a pod that gives money oh yeah this one right here how to get money or cash oh yeah how do i how do i make a block that gives coins oh yeah how to get coins so i'm gonna show you how to do that and yeah let's absolutely get started all right so so the first thing what you're gonna do is just go to go server script and insert a script so we're going to make a basic leader stats uh, speed run this <laughs> Alright, so uh, this is the leader stat you should be copying right now. You can change currency, whatever you want, just renamed it. So everyone knows that I got requested by uh, uh, you should make a part, make money. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to place a pot right there. So this is a good part. As you see, I'm going to insert a script inside the part. And then we're going to type this. We're going to say script.parent.touch colon connect to function and now inside this function we're going to have a hit parameter now as inside let's go ahead and touch play this one local player equals game dot players colon get player from character and we say hit dot dot parent say if player then and we're going to say this uh we're going to say player dot leader stats dot coins dot value and then i'm just going to copy all of this and then we're going to say plus 10 or i will do a different strat where we can say plus equals to 10 so that will make it plus and as you can see i'm in right here so if i touched it as you can see i gain a lot of money i am rich than you thank you very much and somehow you may notice that the touch function always uh, you know, it touched rapidly, so I'm gonna add a debounce, so we're gonna say local debounce equals false. And we're gonna say, if not db, then, and I'm just gonna tab that, and end this, and then we're gonna say db equals true. And then, uh, below this statement, we're gonna say a wait for our cooldown, and then db equals false. And yeah, so now I have this. So if I touch anything, it takes about one minute because, uh, as you can see, it it generates our coins slowly. It's because we added a debounce. But anyhow, that is all for today's video. Thank you for 400 subscribers. So if you like it, please make sure you subscribe and like uh, this video. And uh, leave a comment if you think this is helpful. Uh, hopefully it is. And yeah, uh, peace out, guys.